Oh, ha, 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 you want to get spicy? Then you need to listen to how French is translated into English, and then it's, it's naughty. That's good, I like that accent. Oh. Sounds like a cartoon French character, or a French cartoon character, which is the best kind. Well, you, you know what you sound like? A doofus. Mercy Cali, congratulations to our winner, Shivani. You win a $30 mythical.com gift card for Shivani. sporting that mythical merch in the wild. Oh, Shivani's sporting that mythical stethoscope. No, that's, I think that's part of her job. You know, some people wear uh, stethoscopes as a fashion statement, but I bet you it has something to do with Shivani's job. You know, that's my guess, because this, this is a legit medical prof professional. Wear words, we get more words. And thank you. Thank you for your work, Shivani. I, I still can't speak because of my my mouth hotness. I feel alive right now. You know what I'm saying? There's so, there, there is an adrenaline thing that happens there is, yeah. with, with the, with the hot is. peppers. And this is what those pepper heads are always talking about. Stevie, what do we have here that we're not There's allowed to a look lot of, at? Is there a lot of fights at those uh. pepper festivals? Because I want to, I've never wanted to punch somebody so much. You better watch out. I'm, I, don't, I don't punch people very often. In fact, one of the few times I punched somebody is when John Carson picked on you in like third grade. I don't even know if that happened since you you keep talking about it. Punch him right in the gut, man. One punch, one punch. I'm one punch man, that's what they call me. Deep. Just that they name they they base that whole comic on on me and my childhood exploits. That on those cards, those are the the actual French phrases in French. Okay. And French phrases in French? Yeah. Well, I'm going to say them as they're translated in English. And then you're gonna guess what the phrases mean. And if you guess incorrectly, you're going to be punished by having to say them in French. You oh, that's a no punishment. Yeah. Ha <laughs> I yeah. love to speak French. At first, uh, I thought I was gonna have to say them in French and I got sad, but then, then the rules of the game were explained to me and oh, I got happy. Okay, let's hear the first one. To have saucepans hung on the ass. Have saucepans on. Got saucepans on the ass. I think I think that means you're 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 just you're making a ruckus. It's like quiet down, loud boy. So, now, so uh, because we're not using whiteboards, because you said it first, I need to say a different answer. Or you can say that if you agree. That's it. That is what I was thinking. You're That's what you were thinking. You, you're you're clanging. You're like a you're clanging about. You're it's making like too much noise. It's like a bull in a china china shop. No, but it's not. No, no. It's I'm just saying, the audit. But like, just sound. Just sound. It's just it's like a loud bull in a china shop, but it's not actually breaking. So if we're wrong, it's we'll just, say this one in unison. So you're going for the same. Unless wrong I wrong answer. Oh. Okay. It's to have a scandal follow you. Like if there were saucepans attached to you, they would constantly clang and make noise everywhere you go. Yeah, you're right about those saucepans. So we need to say this in unison. Agua de casserole a coup. Casserole a coup. Casserole is a French word. Casserole. Casserole. I'm gonna say that next time I serve one. Casserole. There is a beautiful combination of incense and hot wing sauce odor oh, in here like right it? now. Yeah. Like I am into it. No. I feel like we should make it happen. Incense well, there's and such hot a huge sauce. market. This is like being on one market. of those streets next to a college, and there's a mm. wing place, and then like a head shop like yeah, right yeah, next yeah. to each other. Yeah. I can't look at this. And right as you're passing from one to the other, you smell this, what we're smelling right now. Go get cook yourself an egg. Class. What? Go cook yourself an egg. That means like get bent. Cook yourself an egg. You know, just like skedaddle out of here, you rascal. I mean, suck eggs. Suck eggs is just like Go, go suck you. an egg. Go cook an egg. Go cook an egg. Pretty close. I th but I, you know, the French are, they're, they're like really, Proud chefs, like everyone's a chef, and they know how to make their sauces. And nobody makes their own eggs there. You and get that, someone else to make uh, it for you. No, no, no. In they, fact, it's bad luck to make your own egg. You have to be like, oh, I'm, I want eggs. Will you make one? I, th I think it's back to the drawing board. Back to the drawing board. I think it is just a straight insult. Just a get out of town, bad boy. Okay, so you don't think it's skedaddle out of here, you rascal? Yes. Yeah. It's that. Okay. Uh. Yeah, it's leave me alone slash yeah. go to hell. So yeah. skedaddle out of here, you rascal. Yep, there you go, Link. Hmm. You gotta read it. Allez, sauce. That's egg. O-E-U-F. Oh, that's a 
Satisfying work. I let that fair quill for. I let that fair quill for. Oh, quill off. I get it one of these days. Yeah. What's your go-to English version of one of these things? I don't, I t I don't tend to have that. I like my mom. I can't remember the last time I said that kind of thing to someone in public. And I don't talk to my family like that, so. My mom uh, would always say, kiss my butt. My but mom who's she saying that to? To me, to other family members, uh, friends, people who would give her a hard time, but only people she would know. I mean, she wouldn't like ask a stranger kiss to kiss her butt. butt. But she would say, kiss my butt. Well, that's a good one. Kiss my butt. Maybe I'll start using that one. I don't, I don't have one of these. Like, I don't know, like, if I were to like get into like a traffic That's what I was thinking, someone, yeah. I don't I don't know what I would say. I think I was analyzing that about me myself. Neither, but that doesn't I, keep me from yelling. I I'm like, well my new thing is to just be like, well that was stupid. Like to myself like I'll say like, oh that was oh good good go, good driving. That yeah, was going. stupid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was dumb. I need to have a thing because you I, tend to I, say I'll, I'll be like, go uh, wah. You say, well, screw you, but not in a real way. I don't, Link has said. You've said that multiple times. What are times. you thinking? What are you thinking? That's what Which I Which is not. That's my go-to. You don't want to go with a, in with a question. <laughs> yeah, you don't want as to open in, up the dialogue. Insult. You kind of want to shut it down. It's like, yeah, go cook an egg. It's like, you do something that's apart from me. Go cook an egg might be my new thing, too. Either that or kiss my butt. Bring me something to drink or I kill the dog. This just means this is extreme. Is that a cat? Extreme thirst to the point where you're willing to just no. take a dog's head off and just drink whatever comes. That's out. a bit literal. Which is which is a horrible thing. And bring I don't me, recommend. Bring me something to drink, or I'll kill a dog. How could that not have to do with being thirsty? Well, yeah, it's I kill the dog. It's not all. It's not a I will kill the dog. It's I. It's almost as if the person's holding the dog. I'm gonna kill and this a knife. dog. Yeah, it's a threat. It's I, I'm so thirsty that if you don't serve me right now, I'll kill this dog that we're all gonna wipe our hands on after the meal. Isn't that what they do in France? The dog is under the table and they just wipe their hands on it like a na big napkin, right? That's what they do in France at the, at the finest restaurant. Your stomach made a noise when you were done. He got he like, got a wing. You're like, don't uh, you? Oh, don't the you, wing moved. It, it went ring, ring, ring. I you know I read about dogs doing that in the in the medieval days and I was like man that's a good I mean that's awesome dogs love that because dogs I, like to lick themselves and if you a dog gets petted if you wipe some like chicken grease on a dog and then a dog licks itself everyone wins so in do you need France. to do you need to pet the part of the dog that he can that he can reach dogs can reach can, basically everyone dogs can't dogs cannot lick their own backs other dogs can though no. if you got if you you got to have two dogs, and you and no, just one for your left hand and one for your right. I hand. think you you need to. I mean, if you only have one dog, you're going to be rubbing sauce on the places that you're not going to want to rub sauce because that's the only places they're able to lick. I'm that, talking about the wiener. Well, that's why you need a female dog. I, I'm always I'm scared. I mean, with Jasper, I've been I've been kind of scared to to pet him because I like yeah. to go in for the belly rubs, and then you get a little poke on one side of your hand. And I'm like, I don't want that. Yeah, I've had to, you know, you're used to a, a, a female dog and then all of a sudden you got you you, you got to change your your rub places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, <laughs> rub, the rub zone decreases. Yeah, it does. I think my answer to this is it's more general. It's not about thirst, but it's like, it's applying like I want, I want whatever the context is so bad. Whatever the context. So it's just more general. And I think it's about thirst. Uh, I think you both have to read in unison because it's do as I say and be quick about it. So it's not about want at all. La chien. La chien. Chien. Well, this is incorrect. Yeah, 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 yeah that's they, incorrect. We, we've taken French. Just read the French. Well, I'm looking at the pronunciation. Don't, don't do that. A bois. A je tout la chien. La chien. La chien. La chien. La chien. Man, the French people, I'm jealous of them. You know, you get to say you get to say things like that. Che. Che. It seems like it takes so much work to have You have to engage so much more of your mouth and your tongue. I think you it makes you stay awake. <laughs> you can't fall asleep <laughs> speaking French. All the all the, the noises that they have to make. <laughs> We've taken all the edges yeah. off. English is taking all the edges off. A bois. Oh j'ai tout. Hit us with another one. 
I'll tell let's hit them with the ear biscuits yeah. promo. Oh, Listen to our right. podcast, Ear one. Biscuits. Two lifelong friends talking about life for a long time. We gave our wives mm. a survey. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then we're gonna process the results and see what we learn. We just celebrated our uh, you celebrated your twentieth. I, celebra- I celebrated my twentieth uh, wedding anniversary, and I celebrated my twenty-first wedding anniversary. We've been married forty-one years. Woo! Collectively, and our wives have got a lot of dirt on us by this point. So, and they, if you're they're interested. So in they that, filled out some surveys. Listen to ear biscuits. You're farting sideways. Oh, oh this wow. is a good one. Farting sideways. I feel like I've done that. I think this is. You can tell sometimes. It's like, oh, that one's. Well, kind of ricochet. The thing I will say about farting sideways is I believe. In fact, write this down because this could be an episode that nobody watches, but I, an idea for one. Um, I feel like I can tell where a smell is coming from based on which nostril it enters first. And sometimes I'm like, this kid farted and this kid didn't fart. You know what I'm saying? You always, you're flanked by children who are who could fart at any Well, moment. usually it's trying to figure out which one of my kids farted, and I right. can usually tell it. Oh, you That's did. why you try to get in between them so you can sniff hit, it out. Hit the left nostril first. But I actually think that you're farting sideways. Hold on, hold sideways. on, don't, 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 don't tell me first. You've said all of them first. Well, you gotta be quick, man. You gotta be farting quick. sideways. I think it's like you got, you've, you've suffered some sort of trauma. So you're literally farting sideways. <laughs> Like you, there's a there's a perforation in your colon. You need to see a doctor because you are farting sideways. <laughs> I can see it come out of your hip. <laughs> I think it's still coming out of the anus, but like I'm either it's cheek not, is it's smushed, or, skewed the wrong way. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, just yeah. like that. The, the trauma was to such an extent that you're now altered. <laughs> okay, that's that's your answer. I have bad news. So. I'm, I'm, and I knew you were gonna steal I'm, that. I'm glad you I will waited. will be farting sideways. I think this um, is when you're cu- when you're acting, acting the fool, you're doing something stupid. Like, somebody's just doing something foolish. You're farting sideways, come on, man. Um, you are both incorrect, it's you're grumpy. When somebody's grumpy, you say you're farting sideways. Okay. I don't understand. What is the? What is? I never learned the French word for fart. I know that merde is a is a is a poop. Avoir, a naughty word for poop. Avoir un petit travers. Travers. Uh, pay. Avoir un, un petit pe travers. Pay. So pay is fart. Pay. P e t. Pay. Un petit travers. So pet. Travers. So I bet you when pe- when Avoir. when French people see Avoir. that we like. Uh, Pets so much, they think we're talking about farts. Yeah. A fart is a pet. Is a pet. In France. Now, I have made little short term pets out of farts before. <laughs> like, well, I better name that one. <laughs> you know He's what I'm cute. That one. He deserves That one's going to stick around for a while. I got to name it <laughs> Stanley. <laughs> That's how that happened. <laughs> Rover. <laughs> hey, what if we start na- the naming all farts? Well, I, well, I wouldn't have any. I'd have no time left in the day. <laughs> All right, hit me. Dip your biscuit. Slow your roll. Dip your biscuit means you're just gonna try something. You're just gonna try it. Like you put your toe in it? Yeah, you put like, yeah, yeah, I'm just getting my feet wet. It's specifically related to men. Dip your biscuit. Um <laughs> What do men have that looks like a biscuit? This is what <laughs> This is when you dip your scrotum in something. <laughs> this is when you. T- <laughs> this is when you're testing the temperature of something, and the scrotum is the most te- temperature sensitive of all things. That's why sometimes they go up in there at a certain yes, right. certain degree. Yes, right. Yes. So uh, I tend to test like tap water temperature with my so, scrotum. Okay. <sighs> of course, no one when no one's watching. Let's say everybody leave the room. Dad's got to see. You. What the temperature of this faucet is. I, please <laughs> let that not be correct. So that's what it is. No, it, I, I mean, the funny <laughs> thing is, is that I skipped around on my scoreboard because I wasn't sure if I could say the word on YouTube, and then I went to this one, and then this is what the conversation is. <laughs> What's the biscuit if it's not, maybe it's. Oh, it's just one ball. That's what it is. No, shut up. I'm thinking over here. I don't know what a biscuit could be. A man's biscuit. It's your it's beard. Like, Dip your biscuit. Just stick your beard in it a little bit. Okay, but like if it was if it was your scrotum, 
then what would the phrase really mean? It would mean have sexual intercourse. <laughs> Is that how you do it? That's not how you. That's not how you do it. <laughs> you made. Oh, it's you mean, not come out of. You mean you put? You, don't, the, you use this. You use the. <laughs> yeah, you use the, you use the wiener. <laughs> Yeah, not the biscuit. Well, dang, the next 20 years of my marriage are going to be interesting. <laughs> wow. Uh, I've had a lot of fun, so... <laughs> 21 years of trying to get the biscuit in there. <laughs> like, Y'all make a good pair. <laughs> You've been working She's, on... She hadn't complained. <laughs> <laughs> so we're right, right? We are right. I haven't given an answer, and you know what? I'm not going to... <laughs> It means to sleep around. Ah, oh. yeah, dip your biscuit. So I mean, uh, that means you get to read it, man. Trompe, son biscuit. Trompe son biscuit. I mean, trompe son biscuit. There it is. A Trump perfect example biscuit. of why French is better than English because we look at that word and we say biscuit, and they look at it and they say biscuit. Biscuit. I mean, like, that's so much better. Trompe. So much better. Trompe the French, son biscuit. You know what? The French think that they're better, and they are. Trompe son biscuit. Trompe son biscuit. Unleash your legendary style with our line of mythical grooming and personal care products. Available now at mythical.com.